In GTA 5, the bullets will damage and deflate car tires. In Cyberpunk, there seems to be no damage effect. In GTA 5, there's a bullet splash when shooting water. In Cyberpunk, the bullet impact is non-existent. The same applies for both with grenades in water. If you jump out of a moving car in GTA 5, it goes exactly how you would expect it to go. In Cyberpunk, your character lands on two feet no matter how fast you are going. The tire burnout effect looks good on both games. In GTA, the tires will overheat and explode. In Cyberpunk, you can go on forever. How do drivers react to you standing in the road? In GTA, the drivers will lose their patience and drive around you. It seems nobody's in a rush in Cyberpunk as the drivers will wait forever for you to move. When jumping into water, GTA has a diving animation. Cyberpunk does not. Swimming feels smoother in GTA 5. In Cyberpunk, your head is constantly bobbing in and out of the water, creating an annoying swimming effect. In GTA 5, fire will spread through grass and trees. In Cyberpunk, it doesn't spread and only lasts for a few seconds. If you are hit by a moving car in GTA, you will be sent flying with each crash feeling different. Oh, crap. That hurt. In Cyberpunk, the animation is the same every time. If you punch an NPC in GTA, they will fight back or run away. In Cyberpunk, nobody puts up a fight, and the only outcome is the NPC running away. This fucking city!